Hi right, guys, so today's gonna be a little bit different of a video and sorry for posting so many back to back But um, I had to prove this point because I'm incredibly petty and somebody was Basically there was a reddit post and somebody had a huntress and everybody's like why are you using huntress carpenter so much better? And I was like well huntress can do more damage than carpenter and the, everybody is super insistent. The Reddit community took a side and everything. He was just like, no, there's no way that Hunter's damage can outscale Nailed It, which is four times damage. And I was like, well, with crit, back attack, Hunter's can do more damage than Carpenter. And this person was just still being incessant because I'm sure he watched a video that was telling him that Carpenter was the best, which he probably is because he's, it's a 100% chance you're going to get nailed it. You can get crit pretty high. Um, when you get maxed out, but you're not going to get it to 100%. So I'm not saying that Huntress is necessarily better, but she definitely does more damage. 100% does more damage. So I'm just going to prove that point in this video. Alright guys, so now I'm going to show you that everything I'm using is the same, like, for both of them. First off, the class relics, same. 100 for Carpenter, 100 for Huntress. There's no, I don't have the Huntress like super maxed out or anything just to prove my point. Um, and my crit's not maxed out yet, my crit chance or crit damage is maxed out yet, but still it does the same damage. And the only thing is, these all scale the same with Carpenter and Huntress. There's nothing that Carpenter scales with that the Huntress doesn't. She scales with so much more things than him because of crit and back attack, which was the whole point I was making. Um, I'm one of those people that I'm pretty good to prove wrong because when you prove me wrong I'm usually like I'll either get quiet about it or I'll just listen to you or I'll admit I'm wrong but do not say some dumb shit and let me be right that is like the worst thing you can do because I am so petty and I like to prove that I'm fucking right especially if you didn't put any thought into what the fuck you were saying you just kept spamming it it's like bro the, the, another difference I'm gonna make just to help his case is I'm gonna give the Carpenter Pearl gems, gems. But it's not even to help his case, it's just to make it fair, right? Because he doesn't scale with crit damage. He does not crit, get crit damage. And I'll put him on the backside just to prove he doesn't get back attack. I will also just show the crits on janitors because he was trying to make the point Huntress can't be better because her passive doesn't scale with her crit or anything. That's not the point. Crit does more. I could probably put it on any champion and them do more damage. Uh, the passive is just bonus. Like, and just to show, you don't get anything for the janitor. Like, there's no, there's no uh, scaling with her passive for janitor. There's just not. You got the dark swords, but not the janitor. So that's just, just to prove that point as well. It's not about the passive. The passive isn't why she's better. Really, almost anybody could probably crit more than the Carpenter. I'm not going to prove that point because that's not what I'm trying to prove here, but... Let's see. Let me make sure I got everything on him that needs to be on him real quick before I do this. Also, I'm using Soul Guardian because obviously he has the most crit damage. So... Alright, so he's got the Essence Shield, which has oh, the best Cosmic Shield. Okay. So this is exactly what we're going to put on the Huntress as well, but let's see how much damage Nailed It does real quick to a Janitor. I don't think the damage actually changes for Carpenter based on who he's fighting against, but just just so we can say we did everything the same way. Uh, let's see, we'll do it at like a super low level just so I can get to the Janitor faster because with the Huntress I don't have 100% crit. I don't think it's possible to get 100% crit on here besides maybe with the key, possibly, because that's like a 40% crit chance. Um, I don't think it is in this game yet. In Soda Dungeon 1, it was definitely possible, but I don't think it is in Soda Dungeon 2 yet. Um, I wish I had just bought my clock. I just saved up enough money for the clock. That's why it kind of took me so long to actually prove this point, because he said that like two days ago. But I've been busy with school and work, and I was trying to farm my clock, so I didn't really care to prove it yet. Continue on current path. But yeah, I was just like, uh, I hate when they, um, people say things and they don't like, and they, they double down on it. It's like, don't double down on it if you don't know. You obviously, dude obviously hadn't ever tested it or even that he just said, oh, there's, Blade Master's the only one that can crit that hard. Wrong. So even there, you see he does 4.7k damage. And this is like a noticeable amount of damage too. Oh, he doesn't have a guard. What? Oh, I fucked up. Alright, now, 
I can't believe I got all the way here and didn't realize that Soda Junkie didn't have a freaking defend. I didn't know that. Boom. 4.7k damage. As we showed, everything's on him. 4.7k damage. Now, to prove my point, this is gonna take some edits because I gotta make sure I crit. I have like a 30% chance to crit or something, maybe a little bit more, but just because I'm trying to do it on the janitor, it's gonna be a little bit harder, even though the damage will be roughly about the same. All right, guys, we're gonna put the Soul Guardian on. Got the same shield, same armor, nothing for power boost over there. Take off the doodle, we'll put another Lucky Clover, Clover, Clover. In case somebody's not familiar familiar with the game and thinks that that actually does something. All right, target gem. The reason why we're using target gem is because she actually gets crit damage. Carpenter does not, so he needs pearl gems to even have a fair chance of this. All right, now I gotta grind just to get like a perfect crit on the <laughs> janitor just to prove my point, because I don't want to have the damage passive just to show how much damage she does without the passive. Let's see if I get it on the first try. That'd be insane. It wouldn't be actually insane because my crit chance isn't that low, but... Defend. 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 And he turned around! Oh, unfortunate. That is unfortunate. And I got the crit, goddammit. Son of a bitch. Alright, let's see if we can get it this time. Don't you turn around, Janitor Man. There we go. Boop, boop, boop. 6.4k wow is that more than 4.7 i'm not sure it looks like a bigger number but i could be wrong my math could be off but uh thanks for watching as always guys i'm glad i could i captured that on like the second try the first try the damn janitor turned around on me so but even then like the point even without the back attack i do 4.2k damage with the huntress and the thing is with it this isn't even maxed out yet, so I would get like another, you get about 0.5% per level. So I could get 100 more levels, I could get about a, roughly around 50% more damage on my uh, critical damage. And the thing is with this, is as you get further and further, the amount of essence goes up as you level your relics. So at a certain point, leveling these to 250 is not going to cost you barely any essence compared to these, because you're going to level these forever pretty much. So yeah. Huntress can do more damage to Carpenter. Crit and back attack scales harder than nailed it. That's just fact. Like you can you can like Carpenter more, especially with the guaranteed damage from nailed it. But don't sit there and tell me that she doesn't do as much can't do as much damage as to Carpenter. And that's without using her passive. The passive is just a bonus. Like that's why she's why I would choose the Huntress over the other characters, like over the Blade Master or the. Uh, nurse or anybody else that could hit somebody that's the only reason i would use huntress because that passive is just an additional bonus that you get but yeah thanks for watching as always guys uh, i'll try to keep the petty videos to a minimum i just had to kind of vent <laughs> because that uh, all right guys bye